Once upon a time, far, far, away, there was a father, a son, and a holy ghost. It all began. What? Who are you? What do you want? Don't fear, Mary. I am your heavenly father. I have chosen you to be the mother of my son. Please, father, can't you pick someone else? I am to be married soon. I'm begging you. No, you are the one. Now get over here. Please, father. No! No! Get away from me. Help! Help! I am being raped. Joey, you need to come over right away. I had a nightmare last night. But when I woke up it wasn't a dream, it is real! Hey Mary, what's up? Joey, I don't know what to say. I went to sleep and I had a dream I was visited by the Heavenly Father. He raped me. Look! What do we do? I'm so scared! Mary, I don't understand what is happening either. It's okay though. You will still be my wife. This must just be a part of God's plan. Too bad he won't pay child support. Oh Joey. I love you so much. What would I do without you? Honey, we need to stop. I think the baby is coming. Nothing else was vacant. We better stop here. Who are those people waiting for us? The three wise men have brought presents. Oh, look. Baby Jesus has been born. So, now that the story is over, doesn't it just seem a little strange to you how this fits into our idea of reality? I mean, it's like... God came down, slept with a woman and had a baby. Like, why would he do that? Like, duh, couldn't he just zap her or something? And if that wasn't enough, he turns around and blames it on your average Joe. Seems to me, Christianity is built on myths and fairy tales. No wonder so many people join. Thanks for watching this public service announcement. Educate yourselves, read history, change the world. Have a great day.